Question number 16 is from principle of communication and the question has been set from the topic amplitude modulation where it says a signal of frequency 5 kilohertz so F signal so let me write that is 5 kilohertz is amplitude modulated on a carrier wave of frequency 2 megahertz generally the signal frequency is also called as the modulating signal frequency the frequencies of resultant signal now these two things turn out to be an am wave and we know an am wave has three components of wave and those frequencies are fc fc minus fm and fc plus fm this being the upper side band and the lower side band. So with this particular key, we have the correct option to be 1. So that will be answer 1. Now let's move to question number 17. Question number 17 is from thermodynamics where it says a solid body of heat capacity this much it's not specific heat capacity, it's heat capacity, is being heated by keeping it in contact with reservoirs in two ways. First, sequentially keeping in contact with two reservoirs such that each reservoir supplies same heat. And in the second case, sequentially keeping in contact with eight reservoirs such that each reservoir supplies same heat. Now in both the case, the body is brought from initial temperature 100 to final temperature 200 that's noteworthy in other words in case 1 100 to 200 is divided into two slots in case 2 it is divided into eight slots where each slot supplies the same heat and we got to see the entropy change in two cases however we know the change in entropy would not depend on the steps it depends only on the initial and the final value because it is a state function so, in this situation, we know the change in entropy is mc dt by t, where mc is 1, and this would finally be dt by t. However, here, the temperature is given in centigrade, but according to the option, these value had to be in Kelvin, never mind for that. So, that's 100 to 200, now take it as Kelvin, and that comes out to be log Two in both the cases because that doesn't depend on the intermediate stays. So that will lead us to option number four. Now we'll move to question number 18.